Hello, this is Tony Riggs with GoEngineer. In this video, we're going to take a look at some of the capabilities that SolidWorks Routing has with ribbon cable components. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to come over and use a display state. It's kind of nice to have a display state that uh, hides some of the components we don't need to see. And we're going to come in and simply drag and drop a routing component connector into our assembly and use this to get our route started. You notice the route looks a little bit different than normal routes. It's got an extra line here. This is useful for keeping the the ribbon cable sweep uh, aligned correctly. We're going to come in and drag another component in. And we're going to show this happen a, a couple different ways. We can come in and auto route between these two components. But do we want this to be a folded cable or a flexible cable? We're going to start off here with a, a folded cable. And we're going to auto route between uh, these two points. Uh, with our little arrows here we can flip the direction that the uh, ribbon cable is going to uh, twist. And let's just see how that uh, ribbon cable looks when we're done with it. Exit that sketch and come over and see what the ribbon cable looks like. So we've got the, the standard red edge. Uh, looks like we've got a little problem with our uh, ribbon cable running through some components. This is just a, a 3D sketch. And we can come in and we can edit that route. And we've got the ability to, to drag our sketch around and um, drag it away from our part. It's a nice use of a 3D sketch to get our, our route going. Let's go in and let's hide that um, that subassembly and just try it a little bit differently. We're going to come in the same area and we're going to pull the same two connectors in. This time we're going to go with a, a flexible uh, cable. We're going to go from that point to that point and let it automatically route. Close the sketch and see what the results look like. So again, we can come in, we can hide the sketch if we want to. Um, it's just a matter of you know, clicking on it and, and going. Now, we've got uh, ribbon cable clips that we can use. This is similar to what we would maybe have with a, a regular route. So we're going to come in through here. We're going to have this be flexible. Drag and drop a connector on there. And we can... Uh, come in and auto route from that point uh, through the axis there on over to this point and take a look at this ribbon cable. I'm just going to let it come through and twist uh, through that little clip as it goes. So this is a little bit of a look at the ribbon cable capabilities with SolidWorks routing. And this was Tony Riggs with Go Engineer, and I hope you found this video helpful. Yeah.